Testing, testing, one, two, three, testing, testing. Hello. Hello, hello. Ara, ara. How y'all doing tonight? Happy Friday. <laughs> Every time I put on this uh, leap motion holder, I feel like it's going to snap on me. The last one lasted a good six or seven months. I'm hoping to get a few more months out of this one, but I'm not holding my breath, chat. Grad work debating science for a grade? Oh, very nice, very nice. So you're a grad student, huh? Cool. One second. This will either... I don't know if that's better or worse. Hopefully it does not get in the way of my... Ah, shit. Glasses can be such a pain in the ass sometimes. Because yes, I do wear glasses in the real world as well. Or I should say, not the real world, the meat space world. Both the internet and meet space are real worlds, just in different ways. I'm on. Oh yeah, wires are the worst. About to finish, yeah. Very nice, very nice. May I ask uh, what your masters will be in? I have a bachelor's of the arts in English myself. Used to used to be a journalist at one point. I would, but it's it is sunny every single day, so it is sunglasses for me. Data management? Oh, very nice. <laughs> Headphones are on. We've been getting a lot of new viewers lately, a lot of new followers. Very pog. We've been getting followers so fast in the uh, Twitch sphere that I might actually reach 400 before I can do a celebration for 300. All I'm doing right now is setting the is doing the announcements of the stream and then we'll get started. <laughs> My head is being a goof, so I'm just lurk. Have a good game. Oh, thank you for the lurk, Spruce. So I'm sorry that your head is not doing so well. I hope you feel better soon. At least it's Friday, right? It's the weekend. Mm, let me see here. Self promo. Advertising on you is paying off. I suppose so. I'm originally from you, and actually, not too a few months ago, I had a I did a uh, ask me anything. I had around half the following on Twitter and Twitch at a time. So, growing this fast since then has been something of a has been kind of wild. Oh, very nice. <laughs> How long have you been part of you, by the way? Are you an old, an old friend, to use the more uh, sanitized term, because you're not allowed to say certain words on Twitch, or are you relatively new? You took a break for like five years. You found it after you finished Valhalla. Ah, same as me then. I star. I found the place back in 2017. It ended up replacing. I used to be a um, MLG gamer at one point, and um, I found and moved to Danger U after I burned up with my previous group of friend online friends back in 2017. Hmm. <laughs> All right. 
Self promo this, self promo that. Really wish I had like a bot or something that just automatically hosted the stream announcement in every Discord that I wanted to post in, but I'm fairly sure that's not going to be that's going to be against the terms of service for uh, Discord. Yeah, yeah, it's a it can be cool. It can be cancer sometimes too, but mostly cool. That reminds me, sorry, you probably have never seen my uh, 3D form, have you? We'll be using the 3D, 3D avatar today because Deus Ex um, is not so heavy that, it, that I can't use it. So let me go ahead and show you what it looked like. Boop. We're going to be using the Cyber Lulz avatar today as well. Is it, uh, which one is it again? It's this one, right? There we go. Ta-da! This is my true form. <laughs> is that M4A1? No, it's UMP45, actually. And the uh, one that was behind the screen on the other monitor is... Uh, a Chinese doll. I don't remember their name, actually. So I don't use them. They're not JS9, but the other one, it looks sort of like JS9. <laughs> um, actually, I have a lot of backgrounds that I have rotating constantly. Mm -hmm. You're a fan of Foul yourself and Bar? Ah, oh, good choices. Very good choices. My favorite dolls in the game are M200, M14... Mommy Springfield, MP5. Um, those are the first ones that come to mind. I think those are the first dolls that I actually... Those are the first dolls I actually uh, gave Oath to when I, when, I play, when I was playing. There's an event running right now if you want to get back into it, and they're giving free stuff to people who come back for a while. But I digress. I need to finish send, posting these really quick. And then we'll get go ahead and get started. We're probably going to go a little bit later tonight. The reason why is because I would like to raid a friend of mine who I was kind of a mentor to in the VTubing space. They're having a summer party uh, tonight, which is really their afternoon because they're in Malaysia. And it'll be 1 a.m. my time. You want to buy a WW1 Springfield in 1903 specifically? Oh, good choice. <laughs> Have you been shopping around, or...? Alright. All I have to do now is post on Twitter that I'm live, and then we'll get going, chat. Please be patient. Your, your patience is very appreciated. Kinda prices all over the place. Oh, rip. I would like to purchase a M4. Or not an M4, an M14 someday. I'm not sure if I'll fire it that much, but I do like the Garand, and I do like its descendant, the M14. Not just because that's the gun that I used often in FPS games, but um, also because I just like the design of the gun itself, and I also like the pain noise. <laughs> WW2 guns cost more, if you recall, which is nice. Hmm. I suppose. Okay. 
The battles are set, and we are now ready for our, bat for our combat. It's time for Deus Ex. Do do do. W. I would also like to thank all of y'all for joining me tonight. Hope you're having a good Friday so far. If you're not, well, I hope your Friday gets better in due course. <clears throat> there we go. That's weird. Sound seems really low. Oh, so I dropped the volume of the audio to play my own music. There we go. Let me know if that's too loud, chat. But the way I can, as far as I can tell right now from the bouncing, it seems like my voice is still louder than the music itself. Ideally, that is the ideal. I wonder if I'm getting deaf in my left ear. It's probably just my imagination. God, I hope it's my imagination. <laughs> Alright. Let's do it. When we last left our previous playthrough chat, we had just punched the shit out of a corrupt cop. I actually don't know what we were supposed to be doing now. We're going to find out soon. The first thing we're going to do is check our objectives list. See where to go from here. Ah, here we go. I went back to my apartment. I've got the I've got the neural hub. Now I need to analyze it. Server wants me to do this in my apartment. One of the penthouse units located in the Chiron building on Grand River Road. That's weird. Let me check on something really quick, chat. Uh, ooh. Beep boop, beep pop. Beep boop boop beep. Beep boop boop boop. Okay, lip syncing is correct. So, we're inside our home. Everything is so yellow. Can't wait to see Mankind Divided where they just completely remove this aspect. Got a gun here. I don't think that we... I wonder if this is the part where we actually leave for a different city altogether. Because I completed all the objectives here in Detroit, at least right now. The reason I asked is because I want to think about going back to some of the locations I previously visited to pick up stuff that I left there. Like my silent sniper rifle or like the rocket launch here. I guess worst case scenario, I did save, like, a lot. So if I have to reload a save to go back and get stuff, I could totally do that. gonna hack my own my own uh, house a little gosh even for me not gonna let me pull apart the fridge hello Adam 59 degrees Fahrenheit overcast outside I suppose so much for old, for global warming huh chat Huh? 
Yeah, it's at a get well soon card. Some painkillers, it looks like. May you heal quickly. What is it with this font, man? Why did they choose the scary font to write that with? And I guess I'm sleeping on a sleeping bag right now. The intelligence circuit. The older I get, and the more I go back to cyberpunk games like this, it's interesting to look back at these games and see what predictions they made for the future and what actually came to pass. Came to pass, not past. Call Landlord Re Replacement Mirror again. Add a sill. A Sarah Boost per energy pack. That would be cut very useful. Unfortunately, I don't really have room for it right now. I like collecting these upgrade kits, but I don't have anything to use them on. They're mainly for combat weapons. Not like tranquilizers and the peps. I wasn't originally going to keep the peps, but after I used it once in a one playthrough that I had to reload, I fell in love with it. I mean, sure it doesn't kill anything, but it pretty much just... It has such a huge area of effect that it's just addicting to use. Nothing like firing a freaking explosion of just pure energy if... But I'm still looking for my revolver. And there's a reason I'm carrying all this goddamn revolver ammo around. At this point, I think I could probably start... I'm thinking... Uh, I'm honestly thinking about spending some money on or spending some experience points on the carrying capacity stuff now because the way i'm playing this game gives me a lot of experience since i am trying to minimally kill people mostly people that i morale from a morality standpoint i don't think need to be killed like those gang people they didn't really need to be killed now there's some mercenary there are some mercenaries that i think i'll have to be forced to kill because the game gets stupidly hard later, and I'm playing on the hardest difficulty, but... Get the big jump legs? That's actually a good point. I definitely should go for the... Cyber legs. <laughs> it should make things a lot easier, in some respects. But we'll see. I kind of also want to get the Icarus landing system. So I don't have to worry about falling to my death. Smart Vision... I feel like it's cool, but has very limited use because I can see people with my mini map. Yeah, that's true, you can fall on people. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and continue the game chat. Living with your cyberpunic prosthetic. There is the... There is Megan. And I'm guessing that this one over here is of myself as well. Baseball here. Pack of cigs. Richard, the hub's connected. I know. Now be quiet and let me concentrate. I need his name, Pritchard, not his entire genetic history. Huh. That's not his DNA. It's the data he was trying to steal from us before he... My God, Jensen. Your suicide hacker didn't kill himself. You obviously didn't see his brain spattered all over the floor. No, no, you don't understand. The wet drive modification in this chip, it allows someone to hack through you. It turns you, quite literally, into a human proxy. So he wasn't working alone. Someone off-site was doing the actual hacking. Exactly. And whoever it was tried to hide his location by using multiple satellites. But I may have just traced him to here. An abandoned factory complex in Highland Park. Get me the address, Pritchard. Because if we're lucky, whoever pulled our terrorist strings might still be there.
Mm-hmm. This gets me every time. They killed my dog. <laughs> Like, come on, man. It's so sad. This game was made before, uh, freaking... This game was made way before, um... Wow. I can't remember the name of the movie now. Uh, the series of movies that Keanu Reeves starred in, where he was a gun for hire, and he goes on his rampage to kill the peep kill the uh russian mafia who whose son uh killed his dog john wick <laughs> this came came out before john wick way before a hidey hole of sorts built with the wall five three seven five At least for years, but prepaid in full. You shouldn't receive any questions about rent, but if you do, please feel free to refer them to me. I wish you many happy years in your new home. Thanks, Athene. On a first code, nice trade work, one. Adam. Frank tells me you also shut down a transmission that was coming from Derelict Row. Yeah, I did. What, what was that? <laughs> it was keeping an open back door into our network, so somebody could get in and obtain our passcodes anytime they want. I guess Francis owes me one. Don't make him sweat it. I want you to focus on finding the bastards who attacked us. Farida, are you there? On the line, boss. Jensen, you reading me? Loud and clear. Meet me near that antenna you shut down in derelict row. I'm doing a flyover to make sure everything's okay and I can pick you up there. On my way. The antenna was at the very top of gang territory. I wonder if the gang members are going to still be there or have any sneak past them again or what? David Serv is pretty based. I have actually, as many times as I play this game, as many hours as I put into it, I've actually never finished Deus Ex, so... I don't know what, like, the uh, all the spoilers are at the end of the game, but I hope that David Seraph remains based throughout, but I have a feeling that he will not, just because you can never trust these mega corporate types, you know? Oh, hey, another combat rifle. Uh, let me see here. On the first code, you want me to try 0451, even though it was different on the... Hmm. I wonder what would happen if I do this. He gets flushed out more... So, okay, so he remain. he's still there in Mankind Divide. That's good to know. I look forward to meeting him in Mankind Divide, then. Hmm. Secret stash. On the first code, try 0451. Oh, what's that a reference to? Was there a key card around here that I missed? Hmm. Back again to Detroit, where a handful of people oh my fucking god. Beautiful. This time, patients attempting to access the Second Avenue Limb Clinic. More explosives. A credit chip with 250 credits. A lot of bullets. A nice gun. A armor-piercing pistol system. An AUD. Glorious. And not only that, but I actually have how many? I have two practice kits right now because I keep doing the maximum amount of effort in this. Now, what to get here? Ergonomic grip? Indeed. <laughs> oh, I, you know, I heard 0451 sounded familiar, so I knew that it was a code somewhere. I just didn't remember where. <laughs> I actually beat the original Deus Ex all the way through once, way back. A oh, reference to System Shock, huh? I want to play System Shock on this stream eventually someday. It's been a while since I played that too. I wonder if I'll get to System Shock before the remake comes out or after. 
let's see now. Don't think I really need that. I don't really need a typhoon system. I'm tempted to spend this stuff on hacking turrets and robots, but... I don't really need those either. Oh, that remake is coming up when Beyond Good and Evil comes out. <laughs> As to say, never. Man, I've been waiting for Beyond Good and Evil forever. They keep pull, they keep just blue balling us with that, with that game. We haven't seen anything in it for it in years. The last thing I remember seeing was that trailer where they uh, had Jade running through some rent, some generic middle or Middle Eastern looking street, and then they changed focus and it was about like her daughter or something, or kid or cousin or whatever or sibling. I don't know. Um, and it was like in space and stuff and they had this uh, cool thing where they were like running away from some gang members and then they had the thing where they like went to warp drive and got shot up by this giant spaceship the development of the first game was messed too i didn't know that do you tell <laughs> I'm so tempted to use the cloaking system. <laughs> Definitely don't need these. You don't need to see through walls right now. And I don't really need the aim stabilizer that much because I've been doing stealth run this hoping for the most part of this game. Uh, but I want to get more carrying capacity so I can carry more guns and stuff. Because I'm a loot goblin. know what to do chap situation at Seraph Industries resolved. Regardless, several violent skirmishes did break out, but no serious injuries were reported. This is Eliza Cassandra, reporting to you live from Pika. I can't turn off this TV now. All the media speculation surrounding You know what? I probably... I probably should go ahead and take the, uh... Oh, thank you. I probably should go ahead and take the... mod, or the mod for legs. Because it'll help me complete the game, or complete more objectives in the game, and presumably get to more places and get more experience points. 
I don't really need to get more inventory space because I've been currently playing a run that does not involve killing that many people anyway. And I decide I insist on keeping the shotgun, so at the same time it's like I want to I wonder if I can actually use these on a weapon. Can I use these in the shotgun for on because I can't upgrade the peps and you can't I can only upgrade the tranquilizer rifle so much. So it's it's kinda of maddening. And I don't know if there's like persistence in this game between like between maps. So I don't know if I like change maps over here. If I go to Hengsha and then come back to Detroit, is my stuff still gonna be here? I guess I can check really quick. Can you stuff stash stuff in your hidey hole? Oh, you can leave stuff anywhere, it doesn't despawn. So, and you do come back to your apartment eventually. In PC, you can leave your stuff anywhere. I mean, anywhere. I left a bottle of whiskey in the Save Industries building and it was there 20 hours later. I like to use the apartment as a weapons locker. I have one of every weapon laying around the joint. Selling guns in this game is kind of silly, but if you do it right, you can make the log credits early on. When I kill anyone who drops a gun in Detroit or any area that has a vendor nearby, I will literally run each gun back to a vendor. Wow. <laughs> That's actually really cool. This game does, in fact, have persistence. So, yes, I can, in fact... Like... And you could, and I could just buy more practice kits later. All right, we're doing a chat. We're gonna go full loot goblin mode in Deus Ex, just like in every other game I play. <laughs> uh, I'm loving it. That's so cool that you can do that, actually. So I don't need explosives right now. I know later in the game, I will be needing explosives. I know this for a fact. But not today. Not today. Don't really need the double barrel shotgun either. Gonna drop that as well. We'll get that later. Drop this too. Gonna be keeping the uh, power boost though. Trank darts. Don't need the sniper rifle ammo right now. Drop that. <laughs> oh man, so everything's gonna be here when I come back later because nothing despawns, everything remains. Alright. We're going to take Sar Werewolf's idea and we're going to go ahead and purchase uh the feet add-on. Woo! Which means I could now probably can you sprint and jump actually? You can. Which means we're going to go back to that certain that one area in the apartment complex and make that jump that I couldn't make before. So let's rearrange the place really quick. Move this here. <laughs> All right. Let's get going, chap. We got a city to burn. <laughs> Is this a... We only got three shots in this, so I guess I better be careful with it.
Liberty in mind and body. Oh, they were so right when they decided to take that one. Mr. Jensen, I fixed up your apartment real nice. That special request you asked for works like a charm. I'll show you a special request. <laughs> Wait a minute. Thank you, Adam. You're welcome, honey. People see conspiracies everywhere. They're saying that Lim's personal catalogs mean some people get preferential treatment. Police. Police. You work for Seraph Industries, don't you? I think it's terrible all these attacks have been here all day. Can I access the... Before you ask, no. Your mirror has not been replaced, Mr. Jensen. Found their route blocked by supporters of the Humanity Front movement. The pro human organization received permission to gather. Oh my god. Earlier in the week, but police decided to shut down the legal rally prematurely and closed the Broadview Tunnel. Perhaps they feared what might happen once the hostage situation at Seraph Industries resolved. Regardless, several violent skirmishes did break out. But no serious injuries were reported. This is Eliza Cassan reporting to you live from Piker. Damn, what All happened the there? The speculation surrounding that hostage situation in Detroit has just blown through the roof, thanks to the arrival of William Taggart, celebrity author and founder of the Anti. Every building is sensitive can afford losing and artists cannot. Front. Speaking from the tarmac at Wayne County Airport. Taggart called the attacks an extremely regrettable affair. I, I regret that this will not be possible because we have no more people. All our parts are currently leased. Every building has tenants that can afford to lose and others who cannot. I trust no you know what is best and will act accordingly. My people have worked tirelessly to find a peaceful solution to this dispute, and I unequivocally uh, deplore the methods used by these hostage takers. Now, that being said, I do hope the UN takes a concentrated Shit, look Shit, man, that's terrible. Mr. Taggart went on to express a sense Our corporation really does. Our corporation really is kind of in the neutral zone. Since it heavily implied just then that they kicked out a tenant just to give me a place to live. I guess Seraph also feels a little bit, um, you know, guilty given that I was half dead. Or something like that. Jensen, I'd appreciate it if you instructed your street informants to use more conventional means of contacting you. What are you talking about, Pritchard? I mean, I found a message stapled to your door. Colo. Alley off Bagley, Bagley Avenue, Avenue. Ezekiel. Ezekiel. How cryptic. How cryptic. That's near Seraph HQ. I'll look into it. Oh, and it's Cholo. I know who this guy is. I know who this person is. All right, let's go over there then. So we're gonna go visit the informant first, chat. I know who it is, but we're gonna go take a gander over there. We're also going to go ahead and stop by the limb clinic as well, see if any new practice kits have respawned. It's going to be in our way there anyway. Ooh la la. Am I going the right direction or am I lost again? Fuck. Probably do something about that sprint later too if I have the experience points for it. Woo! This is too much power for one person. Just being able to leap over everything. Which 
means I can literally go over here now. Well, not over here, but there's another place that I couldn't leap over because it was too tall. And now I can do it. Like, literally right there. Bad grab. I'll show you a bad grab. Huh. Actually, have I been here before? Or is that just a shortcut that I've only just now discovered? Can't access this uh, where area. Or can't access that, I should say. Punk. Open manhole over there. You are here now. We can go ahead and make a right from here. That's closed, so we'll have to go in through the central station. Got some guys here breakdancing still. Let's yeah, nice. go down and to our left towards Seraph Industries. Wish we could wish we had upper body strength so we could pull ourselves up those things. A bodyguard. A few of them actually. What's up, Zeke? I see you got my message, Cameroon. Sanders. You're taking a risk meeting this close to Seraph headquarters. Same risk as you, considering you're the one who let me go. But I don't plan to stick around that long. Yeah? So what's this about? I did some house cleaning after the plant. And I turned up some intel on that gearhead motherfucker who used me and my brother. Chink left the pocket secretary behind. Well, it's don't racist. Don't say who he was working for, but it's got access codes, names, shit like that. Why are you giving it to me? Maybe I don't like feeling like I owe you. Or maybe I figured I'd send a snake to kill a snake. Take her to leave it, pendejo. Either way, my debt is paid. Uh, thanks a lot, Zeke. Get lost, perro. You got shit to do. You are damn right. Let me explore this area, though. I have to remember this being here all right then bam 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 and we'll go bam 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 access granted Oh, that's a waste of a stop worm, unfortunately. Is there anything of value in here? Another ammo capacity upgrade? Thank you. Can I even use that? Of course I can't. Why am I not surprised? Another credit chip. For the buy a lulls, everything in the game fund. We are good, chat. I wonder how the game determines whether you're a black hat or a gray hat. Slave to socks, pre-show when concert live. Sit rep. Alpha team and blue are Oscar Mike. We posted packs of blue legs to cover your six, extract and secure data. 
Rendezvous at Designate LZ for the extraction. Reconvene at the facility. Intel shows you stop. Smoke, pop smoke when you be careful. Facility door code. Dedicated terminals. All access 7984. All access secured. Hub log and password. SPAC store neural hub. Silver at BT.SS net to China boy at zero debt debt at USA. Curious. That's probably going to wonder where that what that X is actually. Pack of blue legs to cover your six. Uh, rendezvous at designated LZ for extraction. We can be in the facility. Intel shows they pop smoke on you. Be careful. I wonder if that goes to... If that's for Seraph Industries. So I thought it was interesting that he... Decided to visit so close to Seraph Industries. So... So to speak, right? Let's see if it opens anything back here. The men and ladies restrooms. Cafeterias and a helipad. Security manager's office. It doesn't show up here. Which makes me curious. You're gonna make dinner, you'll be back. We'll be here. Have a good dinner. Let's go upstairs, chat. I'm so used to not being able to sprint. I'm so I'm so not used to being able to be to being limited in my sprint, I should say. Kind of annoyed. R&D is closed. For obvious reasons. I wonder if I'm overthinking it. Maybe that code is specifically for the area that I found it in. Which means somewhere in Detroit. And not here in my own building. Can't access that elevator. David's not here either. And I can't access his computer. Are you holding out on me, old man? No? 
Nothing in the bathroom, perhaps? No man-sized vents to crawl through? Under Booba? Yeah, I'm probably overthinking a chat. Let's go ahead and leave the area. Head back downstairs. Head back outside. <gasps> Ow. Well, that was dumb. I'm not losing out on 30 health because of a bad jump. That's really dumb. I would much rather reload the save. Presumably the save to actually enter the building. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Who goes there? Steal up! It's up, it's up, 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 up. Your subscription's augmented. St yes, it is, Steel. Ah. Here, I learned how to block your attacks. One of my arms is not working properly. There, there we go. Yeah. I'm protected. I'm using a force shield here. Ah. Stop. Ow. Just, these glasses are expensive. There. There. I think... I think it's... This is not going to end, is it? For freaks, stop! Ah! But come on, there we go. Steel, thank you so much for the resub. How you doing today? Has it really been eight months? Wow. Why so many objects? I mean, I reduced the number of objects it should be sending by like half. It used to send a thousand objects, now it should be five hundred objects. How's your Friday so far? Beer has been drank. Hot? Yes, you are. Anyway, um... Uh... Yeah. More Deus Ex tonight. <laughs> I recently have discovered... That apparently there's persistence in these games, so I dumped a bunch of my extra items in my apartment where they will remain until I find a use for them or until I need them. And since I now have this knowledge, what I'm going to go ahead and do is pick up the other weapons in the game that I've avoided and bring them back to my apartment to dump them there in case I need them. You know, like the rocket launch here. Day of Sex. Yes, the day of sex is here at last. It is a good evening for Deo. Day for Dio. Welcome to Wayland. Would you say the police were overly violent? Overly violent? The hell? I don't know. That's a police. It's a uh, journalist. Will you be purchasing anything today? Oh, well, let's see if there's anything to purchase, honey. But why are you selling typhoon ammo here anyway? That's always kind of fucked me up. I will go ahead and hypo stim the shit out of myself. I can afford to. Always a pleasure, sir. The reason being that this actually increases my life, at least for a time being. 175. I think that's a hundred and yeah, that's around fifty each. Maybe a little bit hmm. Examine. Again, temporary increase of 50 health points up to a maximum of 200. Okay, so it's going to be at 175, and I'm going to keep the OR. other one for right now. Dr. Kempinski, the OR. I would get the Sire Boost uh, Jar, but I don't really need that right now, so we're going to keep it there. The journalist seems to have vanished. 
Big news day in Detroit. A hostage taking and a protest might bump the regulation debate out of the headline slot. <laughs> so we're going to go around for a little bit. Before we continue the main game, I would like to go around and just start grabbing the shit out of extra weapons. Sell what I don't need. Keep the rest in my house. In my apartment. There's a rocket launcher up here, chat. So we need to go grab that. Incidentally, that's the pl next place I need to go anyway for the uh, extraction mission. That's weird. Why is it not showing up? It should be up there. Wonder if the gas stations sell anything new. How may I be of service? Damage upgrades and burst rounds system for the shotgun, AUDs, and be mine. Sure to tell all your friends. It just not the cops. <laughs> I am the cops, or I was. I was the cops. One point. I wonder if there's anything up here in the gas station, actually. Ah, I got experience points for that. Hog. The game really do be generous with them experiences. Eliza Kazan. A reject from a Final Fantasy, from a Final Fantasy game. Can you increase the height that you can jump in this game? No, but you can jump silently. I'm gonna hurt myself though if I don't have the Icarus landing system. Hey, where'd this guy go? I hope they didn't get spirited away. For giving me information. Let's see now. Oh, Jenny's still here. You did a good thing, Jensen. Once a good cop, always a good cop, huh? Where is that now? It's hard to miss because it literally has a ramp. That's basically what's telling you that, oh, you're supposed to be able to jump across from there. The problem is... You can't get there without mods, or without your abilities. And I'm trying to remember where it was. It's probably this one, actually. Yep, here it is. Alright, to infinity and beyond! We made it, chat. Have I been here before? have been here before. Yeah, I remember this place now.
Bin Laden. Feels like it feels like years ago when I last heard that name. Which makes sense because it was years ago when I, before I last heard that game I heard that name. Since I last heard that name. Since since Lulz had a fucky wucky and did not speak properly for a second there. Yeah. You could just throw boxes. Nothing of value over here though. Mildly disappointed that it turns out this was just another entrance into this apartment complex and I didn't need to learn that after all, but I am confident that this ability to jump to high places will become useful later anyway. I mean, there are a lot of uh, rooftops in Detroit. There's no way I could climb that, is there? Always wanted to test the limits of our powers. I'm gonna reduce the light of this key light in front of me really quick. So I can feel like it's starting to blind me. Feels a little bit hot too. Hopefully it does not affect the quality of my tracking. Testing one, two, three. Uh, looks like my lip syncing is fairly the same. Perhaps even better? Interesting. Well, as long as everything is tracking properly, and as long as I'm not being blinded by the lights. What else we got here? Why didn't this thing break? <laughs> I meant to do that chat, totally. Make a left here. Now I really am curious how far I can go with this power. All this delicious, delicious ammunition. And of course, a science sniper rifle. Which takes up a lot of room. Combine this, though, with the science sniper rifle to have a augmented science sniper rifle. Which I can't use right now. Because I left the ammunition back in my home. Lots of combat rifle ammo here too that I can take with me. I'll just remember to come back here later. I could also just move this crate if I so wish. Get this out of the way. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Do 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 do.
Derp. Derp. Ugh. I'm kind of paranoid about helping or hurting myself now. Can't hack the apartments from the outside in. Welcome home, Mr. Jensen. It's true. They do remain persistent after all. Very pog. How much? Twelve bullets now. Okay. Interesting. Leave that there for now. And we check it really quick again. It retains. Cool. So the sniper sign sniper rifle will remain there for now. Doesn't look like I can actually combine the laser targeting system, or can I? I don't even know if it's really necessary to do that because. I guess I could always buy more, but... I don't think a laser targeting system is really necessary for the sniper rifle because you're going to be sniping with it. That doesn't... You can't really no-scope with that. You know? It's cool that you can go through the secret stash. Pistol armor piercing system. Take my credit chips really quick. Very nice, very pog. Combine. Quantum tunneling armor piercing system ionizes the weapon's projectiles, allowing them to penetrate most armor types before reverting and causing massive damage. The effect is limited and will not allow penetration through walls and such. It says it's for a pistol. I wonder if I can use this for the revolver. Probably not though, because there are two different things for the purposes of this game. There we go. Thought so. It's only for the pistol. Now my pistol looks even cooler. However, we will not be using the pistol here, so we'll drop it for now. Leave 
we need to go get the rocket launch here really quick. And we'll be back. Does that say 420? <laughs> I wonder if the devs knew.